Let's go. Let's play. Uh, let's play this mission with V. Fuck it. I just like fooling around with V. He's a pretty cool character. Yeah, I definitely like the promotion they did with him, where he felt like evil, but he wasn't evil. But then it kind of turns out he kind of was, but not really, because he's just fucking part of Virgil. He's just Virgil's human side, because that's what happens when you fucking stab yourself with a Yamato. Yamato. But I have a kitty and a birdie. So let's go. But yeah, I just like V's demeanor. He's pretty fucking cool. Like the whole reading poetry thing while you fight. Game the, the best Virgil song right there too. But yeah, he's just especially when you start like chaining those like kills together and shit, like stuff like that. Like V's really, really, really satisfying to play. Like once you get like all his shit actually like rolling. Cause the thing you just sit back, relax, you know, you get to control a little bit here and there. You know, you summon Nightmare, which is the thing you get in Double Trigger, the big uh, Colossus thing, Golem. You can hop on top of him. It's pretty cool. There you go. You get the cool white hair. I got his EX color on right now. The green. See, like when you start chaining stuff like that, it's pretty fucking cool. Yeah, basically, play the fucking violin real quick. I don't think so. <laughs> I he's just like I didn't think this character was gonna work at all when I saw his gameplay at first. I'm not. I thought he was gonna be the weak point of the game, but yeah, I actually enjoy playing everybody almost to the same degree. I definitely have the most fun with Nier just because that's my guy, but. Dante's ridiculously fun, and then V is just satisfying, like, dodging and shit, and, like, doing all this shit with V, and, like, you see, like, doing that is just really cool. Like, I love going to the next one, to the next one, to the next one. That, too, the whole surfing thing when he runs fast, like, that, that is awesome, I love this. He has the best fast travel. Like, I, I like the whole shadow things. Like, he's going to be a challenge if you can put, you know, playing him in Bloody Palace. That's going to be kind of crazy. Because Bloody Palace is timed and stuff, and then yeah. you got to be very precise with shit like that. So, it's going to be crazy. Yeah, but he's definitely a pretty cool new addition character, even though he's technically gone now. He's back into Virgil. Which just makes me wonder, what the hell would Dante's human side be if Virgil stuck his blade, like, if he stuck his own blade in him? Oh, that would be kind of cool. wonder a what if. I feel like Virgil's, fuck, I mean, Dante's human side would just be fucking Dino from DMC, which is not as douchey. Stab a Rooney. These minions are pretty cool too. They're the ones that are locked up. They even break their chains and stuff. They get crazy. Yeah, you gotta hit from the back and you break their chain. See, this is what's fun about V is the chaos. Once you got like everything rolling and you're controlling everything. And you just like, you see like everything just like everywhere. Everything's exploding. <laughs> Oh, double area, bro. We got the Zangief. We got Geeferuni going down. I'm just giving a round of applause. Like I said, this is cool. Now you gotta dodge all this shit. Give him a little tap dance. See, V is about style, man. That's why I like. That's why he fits perfectly. It's not me cry. He makes you feel pretty damn stylish. Ooh. ooh. My boy dancing. No, he really does fucking look like Kylo Ren from fucking Star Wars. Like, it's kind of ridiculous. Love his voice, though. His voice is cool. I gotta check who does his voice. Let's get some moolah. Let's get some crystals.
It's the, all this game needs is just let me play Virgil, man. Like, I, I just want to play Virgil. I like full strength. The nice black coat he got on right now. My boy looking pimping. It's cool how you get his, um... Thunderclap. Reminds me of fucking G Gundam right now. <laughs> I'm about to call Shading Gundam. Snap your fingers and your Gundam comes out of nowhere. See, look at that. That's just cool, man. It just makes you feel cool. Then you taunt like a, like a douchebag. Like a douche. Just watch everything blow up. Try to get him in the air. <laughs> there you go. I don't think so. <laughs> Ugh. I was waiting for the triple shank, man. That too, a lot of those cool, everyone, I think almost every enemy gets a unique animation for those, like, stabbing things he does. Some of them are pretty cool, like the one with the scissors, those guys with the scissors, he, like, takes a scissor out their hand, they go up in the air, and then they just come down and, like, decapitate them. I always thought it was pretty fucking cool. Tentacles! That's why I like this, uh, pan for it. feels like you're playing, like, Venom or something. Feels like a symbiote. Whoa! I didn't even notice charging them up. Things get a little hectic sometimes. There you go, give him the whole munch 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 thing. I think it was creepy looking, I'm not gonna lie. As V though, V is cool, bro. They did they did well. They scared me for a second. And bam in style. 